Hey guys, it's Team Stay Puffed. We're going to do another review for you. So, I have the Legacy Collection from Funko. It's Fallout and Skyrim. Wah, wah, wah. Today is the day that Fallout comes out. It is the 10th. So, I'm biding my time by doing some videos for, me, <laughs> for you fine viewers. And, um... I know a lot about Fallout and a little bit about Skyrim, and my husband Jason, who's the other half of Team Stay Puff, knows yes. a lot about Skyrim and a little Skyrim. bit about Fallout. Fallout. So we're going to switch places in a little bit. Mm -hmm. All right. So I'll review Fallout. He'll do Skyrim. All right. Anyway, so we have the Lone Wanderer, who looks awesome. These figures look amazing, guys. That's actually like dirt on them. There's the back. Brother Who to Steal. And there's only two. Yeah. There's only two figures in this set. For Fallout. Yeah, for Fallout. The set is four all together. It's four all together, but they they name it. See, so like it says Legacy Collection on the back, and it says one and two. And if you note on the front, they have one and two on the front as well. So like one, two, other way, two figures. Oh, 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 oh. One, two. There you go. Yeah, so whatever. <laughs> I wanted to do it that way, and I was like, no, that's not right. Okay, anyway. So, there's a lot of tape on these guys. They're about 20 bucks a piece. We got them at GameStop today when we went by to pay for our pre-order of the game. Because I got to have a midnight launch version of it. I got Pit Boy coming in, but that's coming in from Best Buy. Come, I'm a Gamers Club Unlocked, but we're like 30 minutes away from a Best Buy. I don't have time for that tonight. I don't have time for it, honestly. Let's see here. Got one more, I think. Nope. Yeah, I do. I can see the lip on this one. Too. All right. So they just got these in today. They only had one of each one. So they had to climb way up on the shelf for us and get it down. It's completely yeah, awesome. It was like stuck up in here. It's pretty cool. All right. Power armor. So I gotta get the twisty, twisty ties. ties. My favorite thing. Everybody knows that. I love the twisty ties. Too hard to take out. Right? No, not this one. Some of those are terrible though. All right. Oh, dude, it's heavy. It's got some good weight to it. Um, it is like patinaed. Oh man. So his wrist like moves back and forth. His arm moves to look in and out. I mean, it's not a whole lot of range of motion, but it, it does do a little bit of something there. Um, and then let's see how much his arm moves. So it goes up and down and back and forth, up and down and back and forth. The leg moves, the ankle moves back and forth, up and down. I mean, this is pretty well articulated for a Funko toy. Almost like a Marvel's Legend type deal thing. Yeah. Um, not quite Marvel's Legend, Marvel Legends. I mean, it's well articulated, but not that articulated. And then the hips don't really move. Okay, so um, first thing I'm that they did put all the little rivets and stuff in the helmet. Looks really awesome. Is it hidden? No. Um. Anyway, so that's all that. I'm gonna let him take a closer look at that while I get the gun out. See, uh, I don't know how he's supposed to hold this. They didn't put a pistol grip on my laser gun here. <laughs> I don't really, I guess, hold on. Let me see if I can figure this out real quick. Yeah, I'm assuming that's what you do. Um, maybe not. We'll get it. Yeah. Um, I don't really know how he holds this. I mean, maybe he holds it like, like this. I'm not sure. I don't want to break his hand, but yeah. Um, yeah. Anyway, the laser gun looks awesome. Focus. It's not focusing. It's good. Wow. Cool. Looks just like the gun. Mm -hmm. Here's the back end of it. Check out my back end. Mm -hmm. All right. Anyway, so he looks really cool. I think he probably went all the way around with him. I think he's pretty awesome. He stands up pretty well, and he's got some heft to him. Wouldn't you agree? He's kind of he's a little yes. heavy. And yes, guys, he is very shiny, very very shiny. Very cool. Oh damn! We'll cut finger off. It has some movement to it, but not a lot. So. I mean, it's more articulated than I thought it would be. I yeah. have to say. Oh, yeah. 
I mean, is this is this their first one? So no, they did like uh, Game of Thrones. Yeah, Game of Thrones. They didn't sell too. I mean, they in my opinion, they don't sell very well. I mean, they had some interesting looking figures, but they didn't look all that great. I feel like it, they're just starting out. I mean, they have a lot of tough top competition with uh, Tom McFarlane and NECA. I mean, Tom McFarlane really started this whole, let's make everything look real. You know, and then you kind of lost articulation. And then Marvel Legends comes along and they're like, let's make everything look awesome and articulate it. But sometimes you lose that awesomeness because of how the articulation kind of takes away from the figure. But they're very well articulated. And the fans really like it. He comes with broken ankle. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Um, it does kind of look a little broken. I'm not going to lie. It might be hard for him to stand up. Yeah, it is. Oh, dude, that looks so broken. It's gross. All right, so he looks dirty. He looks like he's been in the waste. And, um, he's been having a hard time of it. He comes with a trusty rifle. Just a regular rifle. Yeah. Um, he's anyway. Pit boy. Look at the pit boy. That is awesome. No detail in that, though. Which is fine. That's I mean, okay, man. I mean, you, ain't be able to you can't. Well, most of the time it's not gonna be on unless he's got it up. You know, he's got it turned towards him, yeah. which you can't do. Which is kind of sad. His fist does move. On this one, his wrist moves. And the arm goes all the way around, and that goes up and down. Head movement. The head moves all the way around there. I think it's a little. Was... The range of motion is a little limited. And then, like his chest looks like it should move, but it doesn't. It doesn't move. It no. Doesn't move. Yeah. Right. Oh, it doesn't move. Yeah, see, wow. dude, it's like fixed. It looks like it should, though, doesn't it? Mm. I mean, he looks really cool. I mean, from a distance, his figure will just be awesome. But as far as, like, posing it and being fist like, bump. yeah, fist bump, dude. <laughs> um, as far as posing it, I mean, he's not going to be all that great his for, like, posing. have two, uh, two points of articulation on each knee, it looks like, too. Like, what do you think it's supposed to do? No, it's two points of articulation. One, two, on each one. See, yeah. one, two. It's fine. So, anyway, um, he's a little hard to stand up. This is bolt 101 on that bad boy. Ooh. See, he's a little hard to stand up. We'll get him. We'll fix it. I don't know, dude. His ankle looks a little broken. <laughs> yeah. But he's, I mean, he's really cool. Like, I'm not going to say that yeah. I don't like it because I do. For like, like their second or third run of what they've been doing, it looks really, it feels yeah. good too, guys. It, it's and like their faces heavy... don't look wonky. Like, I mean, I know it's a generic face, so it's kind of yeah. hard to screw up a generic face. But in my opinion, like, that was where they kind of went bad with the other ones. Like, they kind of look like the figures, but not 100%. Like, they just kind of look yeah, like he, them. he looks, I mean, for their run, I mean, for what they're doing, it looks good, you know. Now, we're going to change. Okay, here we go. Hey, everybody. We're going to do Skyrim now. Okay, we got the Dova King. And some Diedrich armor. Best armor in the game, everybody. Everybody's going to be like, no, it's not. It is to me. All right, let's do this. Oh, you need to show the back of the package. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, look at that. And there's one, and there's there's number two. It doesn't really, it doesn't oh, really change. Yeah, they gave this one has this is number one, and that's number two basically. They did the same thing for the Fallout stuff too. So I can get it. You can do it. Yeah, you can do it. Yeah, we're trying to. Ooh, that's not taped on. That's actually. Yeah, so that's why I was having a problem with this, like, glued on. Yeah, we'll just pull this up and like that. There it goes. Uh -huh. Awesome. Mmm. Mmm, some mm, can you smell that plastic? Uh. Enjoying those twist tabs, are we? Huh? You enjoying those twist tabs? I'm enjoying those twist tabs. Mmm. Oh, boy. He's got a lot of parts here. Okay. Let me... Ooh, okay, so it the, his his little sheath for his sword. I should say I should say swords, but there's two different ones. It is really really taped up, so I gotta be very careful because I don't want to break it off. Okay, there we go. Okay, so here it is the Dova key. All right. So he kind of has a little bit of movement, not very much. Um, uh, it's just like Marvel Legends. You're gonna have to take your time and position them to where they stand up. Those ankles are a little tough, like she was saying. 
Um, he's got wrist movement. He's got his arm movement. His head moves. These heads must move, but they just, they're so tight and everything. Other than that, the detail work on this stuff is really, really good. I think if they give it a couple more times, you know, they're going to have their, their stuff down pat, you know. Um, grab his swords and everything. Everything's taped in this one. Yeah, you can help. Do what you need to do. Yeah. It comes with the two, you know, just the regular stain, or steel swords or whatever, I guess you could say. I know. Wah, wah, wah. I know it's the wrong music. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, no. All right, swords. It's more like, ooh. Slipped in really, really good. What? Yeah, this one's pull it on that. It slips in really good and easy. Go ahead and pull it. Awesome. That's pretty neat, huh? Of course, that one's not gonna go in there. This one's just gonna fit in his hand. Pretty cool. Ooh, it went in his hand perfectly. So. Mine doesn't. My, the guns and stuff don't go in their hands very good on the Fallout ones. Anyway. They need some bad guys in these things, man. Well, they need a yeah. dragon. I would say Diedrich could be considered bad, but it's your armor, so it depends on how you play the game. Awesome. Okay, on to the next one. He does kind of, it is hard for him to stand up, so we're just going to sit him there for now. All right, Diedrich armor. Uh, give us a comment in the in below, guys, if you would just rather see it, you know, so sitting here watching us open these things. You know, we could just skip ahead and do it like they're already open, but... I think part of the thrill of seeing you do it. Woo! All right. Again, it's the same packaging. This is number two. Some DJ. Say it. Twisty. Twisty what? Twisty tag. Twisty tag. Again, the head doesn't really move. Um, the waist is just, I mean, it's there. It's movable. Uh, two points of articulation on the legs and everything. I might have to heat them up just to get the things bending. Uh, very pointy, but it's like, it's rubber. It's like nice rubber. So it's like, ow, ow, ow. Well, no, not ow. It's bendable even around here. The detail on this, that one's a little bit hard, but it's fine. Oh, the detail, even the back. Oh, man. The face looks a little bit wonky on him, but the Dijic armor was like, you even saw it was like a, like a demon hunter okay. slash thing symbol for it. So. Did you catch? Since you want it to do something like that. I'm just checking. And it's we should mention that these are this is like a hard like a like a plastic type deal thing. As where there's a couple like these aren't but like right in here, this is a kind of a hard plastic too. These are hard. Same with the weapons for fallout and everything. But yeah, this is DJ's armor. You get this, this is like to me the best armor, and you pretty much look like that. You can see how it's, it's kind of crooked. It's just the rubber and everything. They were never exactly straight. It's just a black head in there, too. But there you go. Mm -hmm. There you go, guys. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, subscribe, and comment.